north and east to left of uh, seven, compound uh, 75. One, one. They don't trust you. They're not going to let you go. I just want to join the infantry and just like do something as far as like serving my country. Look, have a look at the map, Cox. Or I'll, I'll bring it to you. I'll show you what we're looking Here's for. Here's like, that's all we got out here. It sucks that your boys are out there with you, but it's like brotherhood through misery. Yeah, I know. Give me a second. Corporal Cox, scout sniper, born in New York City, New York, and moved to the Bronx. Love New York. Been like to a bunch of places, and nothing compares to it. It's got a long gun. I could see further. Like I remember when I did my first deployment to Afghanistan as an 11, I was like, I could barely see these people. It definitely instilled some fear in the enemy once like they get like the close shot to them. You got like two people that keep squatting up and down. I'm about to range it. I definitely think I was like this before the Marine Corps. And it's just kind of grown as far as like dealing with things. You can't just complain about everything, so just got to truck on, roll with the punches. It kind of helps you in life too, so to always take the good things from people and just try to instill them with yourself and then just see the bad things and definitely got like thicker skin. You just deal with it together, kind of. You don't want to go through that experience alone. And my team leader, he tells me what he needs to get done. I help him out. I could take my own element, and we work really good together. And I think you just have to have like a good person mm, that you trust, kind of like one of the guys. And but he's firm too, so it comes to a point where you don't want to upset him, yeah. like because you feel like you let him down, and that hurts you more than anything. But there is a guy to the like if you go to the left of the hose, if you go to the edge of that compound. There is a guy like over there that was squatting too. I love operating. Not all of them are home runs. And then you do have some snoozers, which is like, it happens, so. Gotten older, thicker skin, smarter. This is what I always wanted to do, so. I like people who was like, oh, I wish I always joined the Marine Corps or went to Afghanistan, but they didn't. And it's definitely like one of those things where, like I don't have to think about what's like, I wish I did this or something. Like I could grow old, I don't know, I'm just me. <laughs>